Hi, this is Shane Metzger. I'm with the Line Production Systems. Today we're going to be looking at an air bearing turntable that we've designed. This air bearing turntable is for a manufacturer of transmission systems. I'm going to point out a couple of uh, key features of this turntable. Uh, first of all, it's a pneumatic uh, turntable. The entire thing is powered by air. And it has a kind of a unique tilting feature to it. This tilt is designed to go 30 degrees in both directions, 30 degrees down and then 30 degrees back. It also has a pivot to the uh, tilting mechanism to allow the operator to access both sides of the turntable. This turntable is a two position turntable. It allows the operator to work out of one side of it while the fork truck is removing an empty and then filling um, the other side of the turntable back up and then he can rotate the table back around to work out of the, the opposing side. Now let's take a look at this turntable in operation. So now I'm going to inflate the air bearings on this turntable. It's a simple push button. It takes about a second or two to lift. Now the turntable is floating on air and I can just manually walk this turntable around. As you can see it just keeps floating on air by itself. It will go 180 degrees. There's an internal bumper stop in this table to stop it at the position. So there it's stopped. And now I can just shut the air off. The table settles back down. As I explained, this tilt has a rotating bearing under it that allows me to rotate the tilt. It's got a foot pedal brake that locks the tilt in position so it won't back drive. I can float the air bearing table again. Back around to the other side. And now I'll demonstrate the tilt. The tilt is, as I mentioned, a two-way tilt. I can tilt it back 30 degrees. It has a one-shot valve that stops the tilt in the center position. And then I can keep going. Tilt it in that direction. Again, this tilt was designed with the rotating feature. It allows me to rotate the entire tilt 180 degrees. And then I can engage the pancake brake, which then prevents the tilt from moving. And then rotate the tilt back to the center position, which trips out automatically.